Hey Brian, here's a game that I thought you'd appreciate. Um, this is actually game three against this guy, and my opponent knows what I'm playing, of course, as a result. So he, I suppose, ke keeps what he thinks is an ex excellent hand. I would have to agree with him, but as it turns out, my hand is better, and I think you'll see why. So I'm going first, he won the second game. And yeah, nothing too exciting to start off with. A vision we'll keep an eye on. Turn two grim. And a turn two grim for him. So I decide that um, I'm just going to go for it, even though he's in the colors. But he's tapped out. He's in uh, white, but he's not showing white mana, so I figure, you know, even if I only get a hit off the staff before he kills it, that's still uh, a good exchange. So it turns out he has white mana, but no removal. However, normally he has what would be worse for me. He's got back to basics. So I'm sure he saw this kind of a start here and thought he was uh, going to totally own but check out how well staff delivers. Quiet spec. And a workshop. And what's that he put in play for me over there? That's right, Gilded Lotus. Thanks, buddy. So look at this play. Floating double green. <laughs> yeah, I know you see this. Boom. Boom. Have a nice day. <laughs> I swear, that is the best spec I've ever had. Now he's got nothing, and, uh... And, you know, once you get staff going, it's pretty much impossible to lose. And, of course, I throw it on Tez. We got the Ancestral Vision floating at one, so I get Cryptic ready to go. I figured even if he counters here, it's not that big of a deal. I can vault into a uh, mind twist or something. Uh, but as it turns out, he does not have a counter or elects not to use it, which would be foolish. And he gets down with land equilibrium. Pretty much a worthless card now, but it would stop my, um, theoret theoretically, it would stop my strip lock if I were to try to set one up. <laughs> and speak of the devil, there's the strip to go with Tez's Crucible. And, I mean, <laughs> seriously, have a workshop. Have a Lotus. Don't mind if I do, thank you. So off goes Land Equilibrium, down comes Strip, Strip the Island, Tez is about to go get Crucible, except, yeah, that's it, he's had enough. I thought you'd appreciate that game. <laughs> it was totally amazing the way that panned out, and uh, I think the transmute for staff was definitely the right call there.